Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna do a candy jar. We're gonna start off with this first. What we will need is a terracotta pot with the base. I have another base for usually the pot, but this one is plastic and I'll tell you why that in a minute. And then we need a jar, which we will put the candy in. So the first thing that we're gonna to need to do is we're gonna to need to paint the pot the saucer and my other saucer and how we're going to put it together so I'll just show you quickly before I stop the video and go paint it and come back what we're going to do is we're going to flip it upside down like this we're going to stick the heavier saucer on the top we're going to put the glass on and we're gonna use this for a top, so it kinda of looks like this. So today I've decided I'm gonna actually do it red, so I'm gonna to need to paint the pot, the saucer, and the other pla the plastic saucer on top. So I'm gonna to need to paint those three. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stop the video, I'm gonna go paint them red, and I will be back. Hi everybody, so we're back, and so I ended up painting the pot and the two saucers. I just used regular spray paint I had in the basement. I didn't go for just painting it with the latex paint. Um, I just find with the streaks and stuff, and I find that with the spray paint, it's just a nice smoother finish. I did have to leave it dry for a couple days, and it's not as not sticky anymore. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna show you. I'm not gonna glue it while you guys are all watching. I will do that. So with the bottom, you will glue this one saucer onto the bottom of the pot. Then you will glue the glass inside that saucer. Then you will use the other saucer for the top. Now the saucer on the top's a little bit um, bigger than the one on the bottom. And if you don't have, I actually had just a regular cute little knob that wasn't being used at home. So what I'm gonna do is actually just gonna glue it on top of there. If you don't have that, you could use clay or maybe you have one of those uh, wooden little round balls at home. Really anything you could really use for the top just depends on what you want. So there was also this that you can look like it's a little dispenser, like a little candy dispenser. You could stick that there, but I'm just gonna omit that today. But that's just another option. If you guys wanna use it, you could put that on there as well. I'm actually just gonna stop. I'm actually gonna just decorate because I'm not sure what I'm gonna do yet. And then once I'm done, I'll come back and then I'll show you what it looks like with all the candies in it. All right, we'll see you soon. Okay, so I'm back and I actually put the decorations on. I put some blings, a ribbon. I actually put the, I wasn't going to put it on and then I just kind of played around with it. I put a black marker just like it was gonna come out the shoot uh, like a dispenser. Put a ribbon, I put the jelly beans in. The top looks good. But I'm gonna have to hide it because I know the kids will be into it. Uh, if you have any questions, please comment below. I'd be happy to answer any of them. Make sure you like and subscribe and we'll see you in a day or two with a new video that I have that I'm not gonna tell you about, but we'll, uh, we'll see you then, bye.